season is upon us. The time of the flowering is come, yet I fear there'll be no ceremony, no flowering, no joy. Why, it is the finest, most miraculous thing. It is... No, there is no worthy description. But alas, Bodril has not returned. With no one to play his part, I fear it is not to be. I asked the mortal maid for help, but she refused. I have resigned myself to sorrow. Why, Bodril is... Well, he always returns to take part in the flowering. Only now the season has come, but he has not. Why, I cannot say. Go. He has returned to the great cycle, of course. He gives himself to the flowering. And the ceremony is complete. She was looking for one of her kind. I asked if she would help with the flowering. I was very patient. I explained that the ceremony was far more important than her lost friend. But she would not have it. <laughs> Mortis. Then I rejoice. Bodril's first task, your first task, I mean, is to gather the chrysalis. The chrysalis are... Seeds of sorts. You'll find them throughout the woods. When you've gathered them, seek me in Brunwath Hollow. There is more to mortars than I had thought. You have to open the cage! The Jotun filled up on that antelope. But I don't like the way the big one was looking at me. I was trying to find my way out of this forest when I stumbled into these Jotun. They grabbed me and locked me up. Out of one cage and into another, you know what I mean? Please, let me out of here. Sweet girl, but wants a little more dedication than I'm ready for. I needed to get away. She'd go on about these stories her grandmother used to tell her, about creatures turning people into animals. 
She believed them, so there was my way out. I didn't reckon on getting captured by Jotun, though. Thanks for poker. I owe you one. If you see a girl named Marga Samick, do not tell her you saw me. Or just tell her I was an antelope. Huh? She'll understand. Thanks again! Believe it. Something's happened, hasn't it? I can tell from your face. Did you find Orain? He made the whole thing up? I can't believe he'd do that. He'll wish the Jotun had eaten him when I get my hands on him. Please, take this. It was a gift from Orain. I won't need it anymore. Stranger, have you seen a young man lost in these ruins? Maybe with two lovebirds who can't take their eyes off each other. Yes, Turin. We were separated while exploring the ruins. I need to find him. They're safe then. So Turin is the only one unaccounted for. If you meet him, please send him this way. I need that damned scroll of his. I'm sure he's fine, but if you do find Turin, please send him this way. I need that damned scroll of his. And if you do find him...
dead. But I can't dwell on that now. Thank you for returning this scroll to me. You have no idea how important it is. Each and every one. You are as a second Mudril. I will prepare for my part while you plant the seeds. Place one on each earthen mound around this space. You see where? Ah, good. Leave and go in peace, young one. Stand on the platform so that we can begin. You remain. That's not how the ceremony goes. You were supposed to give yourself to the sprites, as Badril always did. Instead, look at them. You've killed them all. This I had not considered. Mortals forever perplex me. You are not Badril, so I must make allowances. Very well. Although this was not as I hoped. You could only do what fate permits. But since Badril should be gone, so should you. Leave Brunwath. But first, have this. A gift of the flowering. Ah, go in peace.
Sworn proud. Hello there. Don't tell me. Yes, that's it. We've met before. We we have. Right here in where are we again? Fast. Hope this works. Bottoms up, mate. I think it's working. Indubitably. Plethora. Effulgent. There it is. Now I should be able to brew up anything I need in no time. As agreed, here's your payment. You're a real lifesaver. <laughs> 